<laughs> Good evening, everybody. Hello. Hello. How are we all? Very giggly. Thanks very, very giggly. much. Yet again. Oh, well, you get laugh or cry, right? Yeah. So how did we all go with the energies this week? Oh, didn't care for it. No, didn't care for it at all. I hope you've all set your intentions for the full moon the Absolutely. other night. Absolutely. I stood out in my front yard, barefoot in the in the dirt, praying to the moon, crying like a, yeah. I had a great time. I had a great time. All the crystals. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Charging out. everything, crying there. Yeah. <laughs> Neighbours must think I'm wacko. I don't care. And you're right. it's all you're allowed to be weird. Yeah. That's, we went to we went to a, a meditation on Saturday <sighs> that was really, really good. It was awesome. With a, a, a monk. Yes. I can't think of his name. I no, can't think really of his bad. name. Hello, Shakti. Hey, how are hey, you? Hey, how are you going? Yeah, we, it was awesome. Lots of healing and what's going on with your hair. Sorry about that. Hey, Robin. Yeah. Hello, darling. Oh, look. It's been intense. Oh, it has it? It, well, it certainly has. It certainly has it? Well. Has. Hi, Lynn. So, for those that are new, um, I'm Tracy and Kim. We're from the Oracle Room. Yeah. Um, yeah. We've got Lots a. Of um, going on. Hiya. We've just jumped into bed. Oh, Hi, Robin. So jealous. I love your photo. Yeah, that's what I said. Look at the little. That's beauty. beautiful. Um, Tracy has a. Hi, ladies. The energies are crazy. I charged my crystals, set my into a good girl. Well done. well done. Well done. Tracy has a 21-day self-love challenge that, do. that we're launching. You probably won't be able to see it because of the freaking glare. Oh, 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 oh. There, there we go. go. Hi, <laughs> Melissa. So we're going to start on the 8th of April. Um, it's a 21-day challenge where we concentrate on ourselves and find our soul self. Um we should do an online meditation. Yes, yeah, we we, we're already we're, discussing we're that. We're discussing that. So, but yeah, 21 day love challenge. If you want any info, drop us a line and mm. we'll get you hooked up. And before we get started, mm. we're at Nuri this weekend. Yes. Can't wait. Oh, I'm so excited. Can't wait. I'm so excited. Last um, year was awesome. What's the times? I think it's 10 until what, four? Three. Four. Three or four. Three or four. Yeah. We'll be there. Come find us. In the main street of Nuri, I think. I, yeah. Next to the vines. Hi, Shelley. Morning, ladies. Oh, from Canada. Thank you, Hello. Shelley, for joining us. What time is it, Shelley? Is it early? Must be. Must be early. Must be pretty early. Sure, my time TV line will give please. you a read. Ooh. Careful what you wish for. Oh, see. <laughs> Casino started already. It has. All right, I'm going to pull a card. So tonight, these cards... There's lots, I've been seeing lots of uh, synchronicities with numbers and stuff lately. Um, so I thought I would use my numerology cards tonight. And I also have um, my soul's journey cards with me. So my first card I will pull is from my numerology. I've got three. Ooh. I have the four of water, the three of water, and the six. So something from the past that has made you lonely is moving forward. Um, cycles are finishing. Yeah. Try not to be stuck too much in the past Absolutely. by reminiscing. Yes. Um, these issues can be cleared. Um, I think it's. I think you're feeling like you you've missed opportunities, but mm. I really don't think you have. There's there's heaps of possibilities out there. Don't try and have the celebration and mm. not the sadness. Yes. I hope this helps yeah. you. And just to confirm, that card says surrender. Mm. So just start living in the moment a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, celebrating the small wins, you know. Yeah, glass is half full. Absolutely, of. absolutely. But, yeah, give in and just go with the flow and let it happen. Hey, Nita, how are you going? I hope this life? helps you, my live TV. Yeah. Hi, Nita, how are you? He, he made me giggle, and that's why I was laughing before. Sorry about that. That's all right. <laughs> Giggling is good. I know. It rises your vibration. Right? It does. Being a bit yeah. silly. Yes. Hi, yes, Kristen. I need to find myself more. Well, jump on the program, sweetheart. If you can't make it to come into the Oracle room, um, we'll do it live via Zoom um, and via email. She's Maybe beautiful, she's Robin. Lovely. She's so, beautiful. Yeah, jump on board and um, jump online and I can send you some info, mm. Tracy. Hey, Tracy. Oh, and you spell your name correctly. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
My ladies, you have our winter clothes on already. Anything? I know, right? I'm freezing. I hate the cold. Oh, I'm dying. Tracy loves it. <laughs> Tracy, we've got the air conditioner blowing. Yeah, sorry, and I'm, I'm freezing. Right. Yeah. But Tracy loves the the colder weather and I hate it. Yeah. And I like the hot weather and Tracy hates it. So it we're a good me. match. Yeah. Right? Yeah, it hurts me. All right. So let's have a look at Soul's Journey. These are James Van Pryor cards. And I, these, these are probably my favourite deck. I love them to absolute bits. So just a couple of cards of the Tracy box. Oh, look, okay. So this card says failure. I don't know if you can see that with a glare. What, that, that, what that's telling me is that that's how you're feeling. You're worried about failing um, and this present situation that you're going through right now is really hard on you and you mm -hmm. feel like you, you, you're failing. You're not. Um, Second card says perseverance. Just hang in there, honey. It's this crazy energy that we're all kind of experiencing at the moment. Um, I know I've been crying for a week and a half. So yeah, me too. Just, just let it go, though. Anything you feel, make sure that you feel it and deal with it and release it. Yeah. Right? I've got unity. Mm -hmm. So it's where your head and your heart come on on the same page. Yeah. Seek out mentors and like-minded people that can can sympathise and can empathise yeah. with the way you're feeling at the moment because that's, you're not alone, honey. You're not alone at all. Oh, hey, Chris, how are you? You're not, alone, you're not alone at all, my love. Yeah. Um, I was talking about this on the in our meditation class the other night on how people are going on the ebb and flow of their Absolutely. emotions. And you go from one extreme to the other. It's almost like having four seasons in one day. Something bipolar. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, not that there's anything feel. wrong no, with of mental not, but illness. That's the but only way I could describe it to my husband. That's it. He just he's looking at me like I'm. But you know. But it's an emotional roller coaster, yeah. and sometimes we need to to go through that. Yeah. To grow. Just make sure you you, you deal with everything. They stop pushing it down into yeah. the reach out and, and deal with what's happening. Belle, hey ladies, I hope you're having a lovely night. Can I have a car, please? Well, you can have probably multiple. A, a couple. You know who you're talking to. That's right. Let's have a look. Oh, Ooh, domestic harmony fell out for you. Mm. So happy homes at the minute. And um, although, oh, yeah, I feel any, um, not arguments and stuff, but anything that's not harmonious is, is certainly coming to an end. And the second card is individuality. So mm. just be yourself, honey. Yeah, as far as domestic harmony goes, I would, yeah, just ride this, write it out because mm -hmm. this is on its way. Just be yourself. You might feel it, you might be feeling a bit restless. Mm. All right, think things through any decisions that you're making at the moment, think them through carefully. Okay, pay attention to your intuition because the night of fire came out. Yeah. Okay, it means fast, things are moving really fast. Okay, um, and the high priestess came out. Now, she talks about having patience. Mm. Okay, where sometimes you don't necessarily have patience. I don't have patience. It's a horrible <laughs> what, word to me. What's that? I know, right? Mm. And you've got to just consider whatever uh, news you're getting at the moment, whatever fast pace is coming, just consider all your options very, very carefully. Yeah, don't make any huge decisions yeah. right now. Because it's an, it's a roller coaster yeah. at the moment. I hope this helps you, darling. Hey, Leanne. Love hey, Leanne. Leanne. Please. Sure, Leanne. You guys have got to make your questions count. Yeah, because we you're are only going to get one. Busy. I'm heat, sorry. Make it. Yeah. So if you want something general, just whack it up there. But yeah. You know, if you want a full count. reading, just give us a ring. Hey, yeah. if you can, if you can make it. <laughs> yeah, make it. Just, yeah, that's it. I don't know what you're scared of, honey, but there's um, lots of fear and doubt for you at the moment. Um, you just need to trust yourself. You just need to trust yourself, isn't it? Yeah. And you're very unbalanced. All right. So I feel like your head and your heart are all over the place at the minute. Yeah. And you feel like you're just doing laps. Spiralling. Yeah. Because I'll verify what Tracy just said. We have the two of air, the two of um, pentacles and yeah. the three of air, which is, you're trapped in two minds at mm. the moment because you've got so much 
It's juggling. juggling. Yeah, I can see juggling. Yeah, you've yeah. got so much juggling at the moment and the pressure, whether it be your head and your heart, mm. whether it be lots of ex excess pressure coming from outside, like externally from the house, it's just you're feeling a little bit overwhelmed at the moment. Absolutely. You've got to take the good times with the bad, yep. unfortunately, and these times are coming to an end, sweetheart, are. because the justice card came out, so it, the balance is, is coming, but it... It's a slow process at the moment. All right, please don't there, doubt. Sweetheart. Hang in there. Hang in there. Love and light to you, honey. All right, so Roy's just put up the Oracle Ring. Um, we are located on Baxter Road in Salisbury, North South Australia. Mm. Come and see us. Hey, come Melissa. And ring. Um, come and join the 21 Day Self Love Program. Promise you, it will be amazing. Melissa, could I have a card, please? I'm going in. I'm going in neurology. This I time. have three for you, Melissa. We've got. Picking it, it goes nine, nine, ten, <laughs> right? Nine, nine, ten. Okay, so you've got stand up for yourself, stand in your belief. Okay, um, believe in how much courage you have in yes. your heart. Okay, emotionally, this is wish fulfillment. Yeah. All right, this will lead you happy to happiness. But just, I think a lot of people at the moment, honey, are going like this. Yeah. With, yeah. their, with their emotions and the roller coaster and everything. So the two cards that fell out for Melissa, the first one, just saying, is self-love, honey. Yeah. I hear lots of negative self-talk and negative self-chatter and lots of doubting and lots of self-loathing. And you just you just got to move on from it, honey. Yeah. It's, it's really not doing you any service, all right? And the second card is abundance. And it's pink, so it's love, right? Abundance of self-love. That is what you need right now. Yeah, so, huh? and that'll bring in yeah. wish fulfillment emotionally. Absolutely. Yeah, okay. absolutely. Take tomorrow. Yeah. I hope this helps you, sweetie. Yeah, love and light to you, sweetie. Hello, ladies, anything for me. There is always something for everyone, my love. Always. You saw me shuffle, right? Yes. Again, self-love. Everyone's on such a downer at the moment with themselves. So much self-doubt. Yeah. Get out. And again. Same. Abundance. I'm going to pull another one. Yeah. Change your environment, sweetheart. Change your environment. Yeah. You're feeling like you've got cabin fever at the moment and you need to get out and just change your environment. I, I feel like I'm suffocated. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I would review everybody's motives at the moment, okay, towards whether it's you reviewing your own motives towards yourself. Um, try not to, try to see what you can learn from every situation and this will be victorious. I actually posted about that today, about everything, every relationship, everyone that comes into your life, it's either a lesson or a blessing. Yes, it is. And um, it's just your perspective. Yeah. I hope this helps you, sweetie. Yeah. Hey, Sarah. Hello, ladies. Any advice on my upcoming one-month placement at a primary school? Very nervous and excited. You, are got, the kids are going to absolutely love you. Uh, yeah, they're going to yep. love you. Yeah. I think it's going to go. And you're fearing it a bit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nurture yourself, all right? Um, don't go in there showing fear, babe. They're like wild animals, right? <laughs> <laughs> Don't show fear. But oh, seriously, nurture yourself. Yeah. Make sure you're grounded and, and everything as well. Yeah. But all the signs are showing that it's going to be a massive success. They're going to love you and you are going to love your job. Um, nine of Earth, which is wish fulfillment, sweetie. Enjoying the little luxury, spending quiet yes. time and successful self-employment. So See? you for, you pushing yourself outside the box yeah. has is going to pay off for you my love. absolutely all right don't fear it though okay hey rachel rachel yeah hi ladies hope you're both well i'm i'm getting better uh, any messages from my loved ones that have gone before me my mum my brother's great auntie well uh, your mum and your brothers all right, i'm going to change deck for a minute um they're telling you to surrender your fears to money at the moment don't you are you are very successful you have the wisdom to help other people okay you're trapped in your head at the moment they're asking you to come out if there is a decision that you need to make that you're teetering on mm. pick a side yeah and and stick with that yeah. okay because i shuffled and the nine of earth came out yeah. again she's sending you love sweetheart love yes, and friendship. She is. Oh, it's pink so it's love yeah 
Um, yeah, that's what is this for me? See, empathy. You, you're being too hard on yourself, my love, and she just wants you to be a bit kinder to yourself at the moment. Yeah. Um, and you've got some big decisions to make. Yeah. And she's going to help you make them, okay, which will bring peace for you. I would listen right? to your dreams a lot. Absolutely. And if you want to sign, um, ask for feathers. Yeah. Or butterflies. Or butterflies. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay. I hope this helps you, sweetheart. Yeah. Hi, Nina. Love and light to you, my love. Love and Let's see what you. we have. Oh, we have cards flying everywhere. I'm going to go back to numerology. All right. We have, oh, wow, look at that. We have three cards that are all major, major cards. So this is a major player in your life. We have the justice card, which is bringing balance in, trying to do the right thing and trying to be fair. Yeah. Okay, the high priestess, which is, talks about intuition, having patience and consider everything carefully before you move forward, <laughs> and awakening. Mm. All right, now awakening talks about a different perspective, have a, a temporary standstill to things. Um, but it's important to be yourself. It's important to nurture yourself. Yeah, and see individuality card just fell out for you there again you as well. Right. Believe in yourself. Absolutely. Just to clarify what Kim was saying, pretty mm. much the same thing. Awesome. I Thank you. Much. Sure. Self care, and I end up with shingles. And up with oh, oh, honey. Do you know what? I've had that, and it makes you feel pretty crap. Yes, it does. Oh, it's seven a.m. over there. That's dedication, sweetie. Thank you. Good morning, coffee <laughs> to you, Shirley. <laughs> All right, let's just have a look. Self care. Okay, I have three cards that have fallen out. Um, you need. It's time for a positive change at the moment. Absolutely. Clearly, um, yeah. you're a bit. Con it's a complex decision to make. You've got to stop procrastinating about a decision that's confusing you at the moment. Mm -hmm. Okay, and the news, there is news coming in for you that's not necessarily going to enlighten you. It might be creative. It might be a mis mischievous. Mm. Um, but stand in your integrity. Yes. Um, the, the wheel of fortune is going to turn. So things will, this is positive change and fortune is on your side, yes. sweetie. And, yeah, so the two cards that fell out for you is effort. So whatever you're doing... Um, it's always 110%, you always go, go, go. Um, tells me you need to chill out and take a step back a little bit because, um, unfortunately, shingles is your body's way of freaking out yes, and too much is going on and you just need to, you know, take a step back and take some self-care, mm -hmm. okay? And the second card that fell out for you is intuition. Yep. So it's your body's way of telling you unfortunately you don't seem to be listening too much because you feel obliged mm -hmm. right with all this effort that has to be put in mm -hmm. you just need to listen to your intuition okay. listen to your body a bit more sweetheart take a step back all right love and light to you my love robin do you have anything for me chicky babes i've been dreaming of an angel lady showing me green and green mist. Uh, that's your heart chakra opening up. Holding up. twin babies wrapped in white wraps. Told you two boys. Yep. November. It's Let's your heart chakra yep. opening up, sweetie. Mm, getting you ready for these babies. Yes, definitely. Right, that's fine. So we'll just check that. See? I know you. Guilty, right? You, you feel very guilty at the moment. And um, you're blaming yourself for everything. And I know you have concerns about hubby and how he's going to take news <laughs> of, of what's to come. I just think you need to rest as much as you can because my tummy's really hurting and I feel really sick in the tummy, sweetheart. So Be a bit tactful yeah. when you deliver news or something is going to come through at the moment that's going to be a little bit less tactful than what it should be. Yeah. Okay, and some challenging information. It is coming through. Um, view it logically. Mm -hmm. All right, sweetheart. We know you're very logical. Yeah. I hope yeah. this helps you. And I don't know why, but that's that's sitting on top up the right way and it's compassion. So just be really kind to yourself, honey. All right. Hey, Liz, how are you? Hello. Can you pull a card, please? Sure. Well, there you go. There's one. There's two. There you go. Oi. All right, we have two beautiful cards. They just it's, go, oh, I don't know what that means. Oi. It, it, <laughs> it's, it's good news. It's good news. 
we have, see here, Empress and Unity. Now, this is talking about lavish abundance, giving birth to new dreams, lavishing yourself, yes. nurturing yourself yes. as you would nurture others. The Empress is very mothering, okay? Yeah. Now, unity means that you're bringing your head and your heart on the same page. Yeah. That's what unity means. And, this is, and these are what I've just flew out. So the first one is... If you can see that, it says personal growth. There you go. Right? That's the Empress. And the set, look, oh, can I just say numbers are massive for me at the moment. See, it's number seven. All right? It's purple, so it's intuition and it's your connection to spirit. And then look what came out straight after. Seven, Get seven. in. Seven, seven, spirituality. Divinely right? guided, sweetie. It is divinely guided. Um, yeah, it's all looking pretty sweet. Pretty for sweet you. for you at the moment. <laughs> if you need a hand with waking up a little bit, or reach out to us. Reach out, really, yeah. with your spirituality. Absolutely. I hope so, this helps you, darling. Yeah, hey, Sarah. Hi, ladies. Anything for me, please? With life, children, work, help. Oh, look, love partnership. So that means if if you are in a relationship at the at the moment, your relationship's about to go to the next level. Um, if you're not in a relationship, then he is really close. Sorry, I say he, I, I shouldn't presume. They are really close. All right. Oops. And hers are on the floor. Uh, mine are on the floor. Oh, speaking about love partnership, the two of cups have just flown out. Yeah. Okay. So there is a, a relationship that's either growing closer mm. or there is a new relationship coming in. Positive conflict, positive resolution to conflict yeah. for you. It is a connection with another person, okay? The the two of water talks about emotion. Oh, look, and that fell out, domestic harmony. There you go. In. I hope this helps you sweat up. Love and light to you, babe. That's awesome. Mm. <sighs> Susan, any messages from my auntie or uncle in spirit? Um, Let's have a look. I might just go this way. We have the two of them. I'm just going to, uh, this is the way I've read it. Yeah, that. that's fine. Um, it's the they're two together. of air, so they're together, okay? Yeah. And they are telling you to start manifesting stuff, my love, yeah. because financially, see how we've got the queen, the ace, and the page, okay? Um, it's all manifesting money. Yeah. It's manifesting an abundance. Now, whatever okay. abundance is to you, yeah. okay, but it is manifesting. You need to start planting your seeds. Good news on final ma uh, financial matters are coming yes. through. They're, they're ensuring yeah. it. And just to confirm exactly what you said, that flew out. You know, if I can success. get the glare off, that's a success. Beautiful. So sending you lots of love, babe. They, yeah. Hope this helps yeah. you, honey. I can hear footsteps. So I don't know if you can hear, and it's like on a wooden floorboard, so I don't know if you can hear that in your house. Go for me, please. All right, I'm going to try these ones. All right, Taylor. Let me just have some cards of guidance for Taylor, please. Well, that says domestic harmony again, so everything's coming up roses. Um, I think you should be expecting a very positive outcome for tomorrow. Um, but I'll just put another one for you. Yeah, as long as you yourself, all right, um, I think you're going to shine. Yeah. Intimate relationships and good health have come through for you. Um, the power of creativity has yeah. come through for you. Don't cry over spilt milk, okay? Make sure that um, open your eyes to the other possibilities. Thank you, trying to change my name to Gibbs. <laughs> You do that, <laughs> and you've got it. You've got to plant your seeds, babe. Yeah. All right. Manifesting. Stretch your wings. Don't underestimate you. Yeah. All right. Set your intentions, my darling, and it's all about your intentions too. Yeah. Positive, Positive thinking. Teresa. Good evening, ladies. Haven't checked in for a few weeks. Hope you're well. Oh, we're pretty cool. We're pretty cool. Just wondering if you've anything for me on my job front. Okay. She has, but they're on the floor. There are on the floor. I'll just try and grab a nut. Oh, wait. Nut, the whole lot's gone on the floor. <laughs> All right. So the first card that jumped out of my deck, this is the Soul Journey deck by James Van Park. It's a death card. Now, don't freak out. It's just the death of a situation. It's not 
anyone dying or anything nasty. This is this is a call card. Um, it is the end of a situation. You will be getting new employment very soon. And I'm hearing March, April, May, May, May. All right. So we have the sixth, maybe June, because I've got victory in the sixth, end maybe of, June. End okay. of May. Um, the victory card has come out, which is victory, all good news is on its way, public recognition and rewards. But mm. through life experience, it has taught you, it's taught you to, to spread your wings a little bit, yeah. all right? Believe in yourself. Look outside the box with the new employment, sweetheart. Yeah, very much. Powerful revelations that are going to come into your life that are and going the, to change them. Yeah, Josephine, and the bottom of the deck is abundance, so yeah. pay wise, better money, better yeah. opportunities. Right. I hope this helps you, sweetie. Josephine. Hello, baby. Good love guidance on my current relationship. I'm going to use these. I'm going to try not to drop cards all over the floor. You can try. I don't know how well you'll go. I don't know how well I'll go, but hey, we'll try. Okay, I'm going to Josephine. I'm going to take those three. Huh. Every time I speak to you, sweetheart, spirituality. Oh, no. I oh, know, right? Spirituality. Again, double seven, seven, personal growth, mm -hmm. right? And last one is self discipline. There you go. All right. Um, Oh, I think there's something. I think I missed it, but I think there's something new coming along for you. Roy is very cheeky. Yes, he is. <laughs> Dyslexic. Do you like? Did you see that? I do, you that? cheeky man. This is the two of cups, which means coming together. Okay, and this is the six of earth, which is bringing balance. And things that you've been working towards are now going to start paying off for you. Mm, okay, yes, so it's it's a calm resolution to conflict if mm. you if you having some dramas within your relationship at the yeah. moment, sweet. I hope this helps you. Love and light, you, my love. I'll see you soon. Yeah. May I please receive career guidance? Yes, you can. All right, see, go if you're ready. You can. All right, change your environment. Yep. I think there's a new position coming up for you that you really need to take because I feel the job that you're in at the moment is not correct and it's not right for you and I feel the workplace is a little toxic. Um, you have the desire to move forward with the with the eight of water. It's the desire to move forward, searching mm. for something a little bit more meaningful, yep. spiritual and emotional growth. And I've got the wish fulfillment. So look at this, it goes eight and then nine. Sweet. That's beautiful. Yeah, Life well experience, done. Shakti. Life experience. Yes, massive. All right. Good luck to you, my love. Thank you, thank you both for my readings and confidence. Oh, honey, you're very welcome. Robin, you're a sweetheart. Yeah. Absolute sweetheart. Everybody that jumps on. Oh, yeah. really? <laughs> <laughs> my ladies, I've been feeling lost a bit lately. Got surgery coming up, a bit jittery. I think your surgery is going to go splendidly. And I think your healing time is going to be really quick. I yeah. just keep getting quick. All right, let's have a go. Hey. See, you're throwing them now. Massive changes are coming for you, honey. Yeah. This surgery is it's going to make way for lots of changes. Yeah. All right. Positive changes, really positive changes. Let's um, see what we have without throwing them. Thanks, Barry. <laughs> thanks, Dad. Every, every time I pull this card, like use this deck of cards, my dad throws something for me, right? Spiritual career. It's just his little um, way to say that he's around. Okay. Has some of the doctors been a bit tactless with you in delivering the news? Um, I know you're I know you're stressed and I know and it is warranted, mm. okay, because surgery is very scary. Yeah, yeah, I've had sure. a lot of them myself, no. right? Um but you need to, there's a lot of things going on behind the scenes, honey. Okay, Theody. And you just release your fears a little bit and your surgery, you'll breeze yeah. through it. And see, that fell out too, which is time out. So just until your surgery, try not to stress so much. I know it's really hard to say that. Mm. Um, but give, yourself, be... give yourself time to heal and, and to prepare. Just, just make this about you right now. Yeah. And, yeah. And one, one, one. Nice, Which is a manifesting number. Yeah. 
between the cell up into two. Must be yes. Well, I know, right? I know. I'm sorry for those who, who don't spell their name. Look at that. Right. One, 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 and 44. That's beautiful. 40. Hello, Beck. Hey, Beck. Love guidance in my future. I reckon I saw you at um, Hollywood the other day. Future with my fiance. Your fiance is lovely. End of a difficult situation. Embrace the change. Yes. Expect things to go better for you now. Okay. Yeah. And the two, which brings abundance. What and new partnerships, new not new partnerships, but um, it's going to the next level. It, it is. It is. And it is. Con it's asking you to continue to move forward, sweetie. Um, I see it. I see it swelling, really. Do you? Yeah, I do. Well, that would be nice for her. Yeah, I do. I see the swelling, really. Yeah. Uh -huh. See, growth. No worries, Belle. <laughs> growth, right? Yeah, no. that's, that's um, the synchronicity. But yeah, grow, well. growth. Um, so I think your family's about to grow, honey, and that's going to bring you so much peace. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Someone's whispering in the Stop it. Yeah, um, I think you're going to be fine, guys. Hi, Nancy. You need guidance today. Health is poor. You need to strengthen your inner self, honey. Mm. All right, you need to have belief in yourself. Yeah. Um, do something because the strength card has come out and the night of fire, which means you've got to find something that brings passion to you. Yeah. Okay. Um, this event that's happening at the moment needs immediate attention. Yeah. All right. Um, think things through clearly. Yes. Please try and forgive yourself. Try and forgive and look through, not as harsh, don't yeah. be as harsh on yourself. Be a bit be softer, yeah, a bit, bit of compassion with yourself. Yeah. Because the first card that fell out for you is blame. So it's like we can't help our health to, to a certain degree, right? Um, you know, if you meditate and it's always positive thinking and, you know, there are ways that we can make our health better. Um, but I feel like... You're just stuck in that you're blaming yourself and everything's your fault, and it's, it's not the case, mm -hmm. all right? So the second card that fell out for you is the death card, right? So it's all of this shitty, sorry, Roy, health issues, Yeah, they, they, they're not far away from coming to an end, and I, I see you turning a corner. Um, I actually think you need to get a second opinion, all right? Yeah. Just it can't hurt, that's all I'm saying. And I think it's something to do with the medication. But I really think you just need to go see someone else and get a second opinion because I think this is going to come to an end really quickly. Paula, uh, hey, Paula. I hey. hope this helps you, sweetheart. Yeah. I hope you feel better soon. Same. Do you see me having a future with a man with the initials J? Jay. Yes, you did see Beck at Hollywood. Oh, I thought so, but I didn't have my glasses. So I, and anything that's like further than that away from me is really blurry. So, yeah, sorry about that. All right, Paula, see Jay. Mm. I don't know. See, I don't know if it's looking promising. I think. Yeah. There are hidden intentions. Mm. Somebody's got good business sense, yeah. but they're keeping things close to their chest, chest. at the moment. Um, excuse me for a minute. Uh, yeah, and he might be a bit uh, maybe challenging, mm. yeah. to say the least, a little bit impulsive. But he's he, I've just got the judgment card, right? Yeah. That was on the bottom of the deck. Yeah. So... Delays in plans a little yeah. bit, sweetie. I would I would look at, yeah, there's the lovers, mm. okay? So I will say think very carefully, yeah. weigh up your decisions. Yes, yeah. and I've got the blame card again. So yeah. you feel like, again, everything's your fault. Takes two to tango, right? Remember that. Yeah. Um, but I think you're taking well more than your 50% of the the blame in any of this and then the, I see bottom of the deck again is adversity so there's going to be bumps honey yeah going to be bumps I think it's your it's up to you right it's your free will if you want yep. to keep up then then go for it yeah you just have going to have to hang on and enjoy the ride I guess I hope that helps you sweetheart Jasmine good evening can I please have some guidance on the floor yeah 
just hang on while she picks it up. Yep, pretty much. <laughs> oh, Jasmine's manifesting seeds. Nice. Okay, so the magician came out, which is you are ready right now. Okay, um, these resources that you're trying to, you're planting your seeds, all right, you've got to nurture them. Yeah. You have to water them. It's like any plant, any goals that you create, yeah. it's like any plant. You've got to move forward, 9-11. Oh, no. And He's the stopping. queen. I'm taking that card out of the deck, mate. And the queen of the queen of fire comes out. When she comes out, don't underestimate yourself. Yeah. All right. Don't underestimate the power of your mind. Do an next week show. Down on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> You're cheeky, man. Do you know you what? It's say, probably not a bad idea. Probably not. Just saying. I don't know that I can get up. On I was going to say, don't feel me getting up because that's not fair for anybody because I have to roll. Anyway, let's move on. <laughs> Cars that fell out for you, I'm just moving on. Completion. So I feel like you're going through a bit of a shitty time at the minute. Sorry, Roy. But that's coming to an end. Yeah. I think your uncertainties are coming to an end. Yes. All right. And the other card that fell out is, is number 11 um, and it's individuality. I think if you just be true to yourself, babe, yeah. then you'll be, be who you are. Absolutely. Don't underestimate yourself, yeah. darling. That's what the Queen of Fire is all about. Absolutely. Hi, Rachel. Hello, lovely ladies. Do you see me changing jobs this year? Oh, have you had a rocky patch this week, sweetie? I am saying October. I see October. Yeah, it's all about communication. Put it out there and what you want, my love. I, I feel like everything's a bit of a one-way street at the moment. I feel like you're a bit stagnant and that you're not being heard. I, I don't know if that makes sense to you, but I feel like you're not being heard. Um, so, oh, get in. Second card that just flew out for you, I'll move my fat fingers, that says follow your dreams. Yeah. So I think your ideal job is on its way, and I'll keep hearing the end of November. And then the third one for you is rebirth. And get just, in. just to point out synchronicities, when your question came through, mm. see this is communication at 33. Yeah. There were 33 views. And yeah. here's number six, right? Three, 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 three six. six. So this is all things are looking up. Yes. You're moving towards something that is a little bit more uh -huh. stimulating. I just split the deck and it said environment. So you've got to change your environment. So, yes, I see you moving. Financial moving wish fulfillment, sweetie. Yeah. All right, happy families, magic. Find something that makes you, that, that you feel that magical about. Leela, hello, Leela. Good evening, ladies. Shared. Oh, well, thank you very kindly. Do you see any big things coming in my relationship? Let's have a look. And as the lovely Leela has just done, please share. Um, invite your friends to come online. Um, if you can, later on, share the replay and put it on your page and put it in your groups and spread it around. The Seven of Cups. There's a bit of confusion on what does deal, what fills your cup, sweetheart. Yeah. Um, it's a complex decision at the moment. Do some research mm. on looking within a yeah. little bit. And that's what it's all about lately. It's just... Yeah, looking within, all right? Stop procrastinating about what fills your cup or... See, the six of the seven of cups is, is moving on from past. Yeah. And you have one more cup to fill. Yeah. Okay? And as you said, moving on, yeah. right? New beginnings came out for you. So yeah. I'll just turn that. So there's new beginnings. All right, that's number one. So it's a whole new start. And then we have the three, which is which, the three of fire, know, which is abundance. Ready. It's also a choice. Sure. All right. And it's having patience to make long-term choices. Yes. Yeah. Thanks to the humor of Tracy and Kim, I am unable to put up a few comments. Really? Don't judge me. <laughs> All right, so what fell out for you, um, Leela, is teaching and learning, all yeah. right? You really have to look at the lessons that you are, are supposed to be learning, honey. I, I feel Moving like, yeah, and I, I just feel, I don't know if, you, if you're learning them as, as much as you should be, mm. um, and I feel like you're making the same mistakes and the same patterns keep coming around and around. As far as your relationship goes, with this new beginning, okay, it's, this is what I'm hearing. There is a new relationship coming for you. 
as long as you have learned your lessons from your past relationships. And I really believe you need to look outside of your circle and you will be with someone who doesn't normally fill your cup, if that yeah. makes sense. Yeah. Lynn. Hi, Lynn. Card, please. Sure. Sure. Justice. Nice. Um, please be fair in any decisions that you're making, fair and just in your decision making, yeah. okay? You you know what's right. Stand in your own beliefs, but yeah. you know what's right. And it will bring Let's balance. Again. Okay. But, and if you look, these two cards, this is balance, mm. okay? The justice always stands with the scales, yeah. okay? And they are always fair and just. Yes. Whereas the balance card, this talks about um, needing moderation. This is this is relates to perfect mm. timing. See, time out. That's on the bottom. Cooperation and compromise yeah. to sort any problem out at the Take moment. Take a step really, back. If you have Take a, a step back. All right, um, and then the, the first card that came out is synchronicity. So ask for signs. Mm -hmm. Start asking for signs. If you're unsure and you've got big decisions to make, ask for signs. Or there's a reoccurring pattern that you're yeah. seeing. Yeah, so look out for them. And then again, right, this one just flew. But it's, it's spirituality again. You, you, you know what you need to do and the answers are already inside you. You just need to listen. Hi, Donna. Hi, Donna. I'm just trying to look at her picture. It's beautiful. Can't oh, really wow. see it. My well, ladies, anything the universe would like me to know. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm going to go these ones. Your awakening. This is your soul journey, baby. Absolutely. Um, the, me the, the meal is turning. The wheel is turning. Is it though? <laughs> <laughs> I must stop. My, my meal is quite happy, right? I can the, hear that. the wheel is turning. Um, and positive change is coming for you. It's emotional. You, it will put fire in your belly, sweetheart. Mm. Defend your beliefs, though. Courage. Right? Absolutely. Defend Stand your up, belief. man. Yes. And it's wish fulfillment. Yep. And the second one that fell for you is empathy. So just be a bit kinder to yourself. Yep. You're your own worst bloody critic. You need to just chill out a bit and yep. just mm, be kinder to yourself. And That's start that. maybe looking at things from a different perspective, okay? Melissa well, Simpson, thank you. You're oh, more you're than welcome. welcome. More than welcome. Hi, Jessica. How are you? Hope your night is going well. Hey, giggles. <laughs> hey, Peony. My lovely military operator is playing with me. Golly, golly, gosh. <laughs> golly, G. Willikus. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Vanessa. I don't think she's breathing. You okay? You okay? <laughs> Sorry. All right, All right I'll, I'll go first. All right, shall I go first? Let's go first. Hello, ladies. <laughs> See, this has come out again, mate. It's that bloody retrograde. Yeah. Everyone's yeah. feeling like crap. Everyone's blaming themselves. Everyone feels like they're not living up to their expectations. Yeah. Stop it. It's just past recurring. Yeah. That's all. I know, uh, I don't say that lightly either, yeah. okay? And look, changes for you, babe. Yes. All right, as soon as this stuff mellows out, it's massive changes. All right. Yes. See, three cards have fallen for you, sweet. We have firm foundations, which is the four of fire, okay, or the four of um, uh, wands. I can't speak right now. Contentment, peace, and abundance, okay? Whatever your foundation is that mm. fills you. That makes you feel happy um you've got conflict a little bit around money and you're uncertain but you have the wisdom mm. all right to to move past it yeah. and the ace okay so you the foundations that you've built move past your fears and abundance is coming yeah all massive right massive changes for you both changes are coming through for yeah, you yeah. massive i hope this helps you sweetie okay, can i have a love reading please Oh, ah. Mm. Sure. Let's have a shuffle. Wait, seen it. Might just do an energy read. Just saying, get in, right? Love partnership. And that's so, and for you, right? If you are already in a relationship, it is about to take the next step. Sorry, Roy, I said it again. It's going to the next level, all right? If you are not in a relationship, then you will be very, very soon. Yes. I see a very tall man with lighter hair. And... 
there are possible oh wow look thinking man mm, right very cluey there are a there are possibilities opening up for you it is you need to change your strategy on how you are how you think of yourself mm -hmm. form contracts yeah. that brings balance yeah okay and these are not contracts that you can write out and sign no, no, these no, are no, contracts no. with yourself yeah. make deals with yourself yeah. and look at that isn't it lovely told you man you want to hear man with the money tool <laughs> coming in get in Cherie there hey ladies Norman truly loved me and we will get back together head over to the oh heads all over the place and I'm worried he's going to do the same thing as well. mm. let me read that again because sometimes it just okay. doesn't sink into me um okay I've got past is coming back to slap you all right, karmic completion. Sorry. Yep. And, you know, karmic completion. And it's All an attachment. Now you see how, sweetie, you see how she's attached here. Okay. This is all about attachment. Mm -hmm. All right. I now think you need to let him go, honey. Take the masks off and see what you have after attachment. Okay. This is from your, your base chakra. So this is past events, yep. past things coming back. Yeah. Okay. And yeah, yeah. I think so I got three cards, right? The first one is adventure. So it's not just a and if you can see that it says new beginning. So it's not just a new beginning, it's just getting a bit excited, all right? And it's abundance and it's pink, so it's it's love, all right? Abundance of love. I just don't think it's with him. No, I I so, think the attachment's a bit dark and all I'm sat all we're saying is just Think things through carefully. Yeah, sweetie. absolutely. All I'm right. not saying that this is no, like, it's not going to work or anything yeah. like that. I'm just saying think carefully, all right, because history tends to repeat itself. Yes, it does. All right. I hope this helps you, sweetie. Yeah. Good luck. Bobby. Oh, what a week we're fast. I know. We'd love any messages. We'd really appreciate it. All right, Bobby. Let's see what we've got for you. just going to go Jane's Van Prague. Um, they went to fly, so yeah. we have things been a, a bit passionate this week or a bit um, taking a lot of action for you, all right? Don't give Stop up in, any comfort zone. Don't give up in anything that you're faced with this, well, in the coming few weeks. Protect your own, protect something that's been created. Have courage, but stand in your belief, yeah, okay? Absolutely. You have a choice coming up. Yeah. that needs to be made you need to continuously move forward try and find something that has passion be brave right courage stand up and believe I'm just confirming them. what you're saying yeah um because freedom fell out next for you right so once all this bumpy stuff's finished and you've the decisions are made and you've stood your ground and back to peace and freedom all right and then the last card that just flew was death again it's the end of a situation you begin yeah right mourn what's happened though um release any feelings that you have actually feel them and deal with them yeah all right don't press anything no but the power of positive thinking guys is incredible oh, it's huge absolutely incredible. absolutely huge absolutely and this is what this is what this is all about right it's finding your true soul self it's not being who people expect you to be it's finding your true self making yourself happy oh i just got chills Wow. Hi, Cindy. Seven, having surgery tomorrow. I'm nervous. I don't blame you, but she's going to be fine, hopefully. Oh, yes. Life is magical. Yeah, honey. she's fine. Life is magical. Or guidance. Wow. Yeah, so you're doubting it. Don't doubt it. Positive thinking is huge, babe. Yeah. All right? Do not just be careful what you're wishing for right now because of the moon and intentions and stuff. Please don't doubt it. She's... She's rocking it, see? Worried about nothing. All right? Worried about nothing. She's okay. She's honey. gonna yeah. Yeah, see, indecisive. I know what you want to feel and what you want to do. And as a parent, it's really hard, babe. And I get it. But don't stress, all right? You're worrying about nothing. She's gonna be absolutely fine. Good health. Oh, well, there you go. And moving. Yeah. New beginnings. Yeah. It's all good. Leap she's of faith, be honey. Fine. Leap of faith. I promise you she's gonna be fine. 
Thank you. Hope that helps you. Hello, Karen. Hey, I got woken last night to a lady standing over me. Any ideas who she might be? Yes. Go on. Honey, she's dad's mum. Yeah, it's grandma. She's dad's mum. Um, something's like, happening with you at the moment, Karen. Let's have a look. And she's coming in to warn you. Mm. All right. She's coming in to warn you. I've known Karen for 23 years. Okay. Oh, that Karen. That Hello, Karen. Karen. Sorry, <laughs> I didn't realise that was your name. Sorry, babe. I going, love the moon, hey. Oh, the game out of the moon picture. Oh, yes. The well, moon picture. Yeah. Okay, let's go. I really think that she's trying to tell you that things are coming to an end. Look it's at like that. And completion. Yeah. Things are coming to Where an is the end. Ending? Sweetie, something, something's moving forward. She's trying to warn you that, yeah, she's trying to warn you. I'll come and have a chat to you very shortly, but fortune is on your side. Yeah. That was uncanny. That was, yeah, it and was. Amanda. Did you see it? Nine and ten, right? Yeah. And we're both completion at the same time. Yeah. Amanda Franklin. Any messages for me, please? Uh, on the floor. Hang on. These are always on the free I know, right? All right, I've got three. Yeah, go. Okay, so adventure, which is new beginnings. Mm -hmm. Okay. Exciting times, babe. Self-discipline. It's putting yourself first. It's about... Throwing caution, not to the wind, but it's doing, it's standing up and doing something for you. Yeah. Right? And then the last card is manifestation. So anything you want, babe. Make your intentions very, very clear, though. All, All right. right. Speaking of manifestations, magician. the magician. There you go. And these are the three cards that flew on the floor for you. It's the magician card. Yeah. All right? If you're ready yes. to manifest stuff. Okay? Exciting things are coming for you. Yeah. All right? This is the page of fire yeah. and past things don't reminisce too much no. but some things are coming back from the past and it could be a love partnership yeah. or something coming back from the past you're reminiscing about it at the moment yeah. and be careful for what you wish for because yeah. with the manifestation card coming out twice now you're manifesting something from the past that's right to teach you a new lesson yeah whether it be a lesson or a blessing, my darling. Mm, okay. Everything's a lesson or a blessing, um, but personal growth came out for you too. All right. Now, that just shot across the bottom, and it says, if we don't get to your question tonight, we are truly sorry, all right? Yeah. But you guys rock so much that we have so many comments and so many questions, it makes it really hard to get to everybody. I am here on Wednesday at yes. 11, okay? Come and on. I tried really, really hard last week to make sure that I answered everybody's that questions. Was missed. That was that was yeah. missed. We had over five hundred comments last that, week. That'd be which crazy. Was fantastic. All right. Ruth Jones, how are ladies? Now this flew out for you, my love. And there's two on the spiritual board. partnership. All right. So I'm gonna pull another card just to get some further insight. And while Tracy's doing that, you're trapped in two minds at the moment mm. and you're unwilling to make a decision. It's a stalemate. You're pretending there's no problem, but there really is a problem. Yes, there that, is. And huh. you, okay. you have the wisdom to get, pardon me, out of it. Yeah. Don't have fears about money at the moment because things will things is going to work out yeah. the wash. Right? All right. So spiritual partnership that, that flew out for you. All right. So this connection, it's a soul connection. Mm. Okay, I think unfortunately you were letting your pride get in the way, um, and I think your feelings have been a bit hurt. All right, but then the third card that flew out is love. So a lot of self love. I think you need to concentrate on yourself a little bit too. Right. Um, stop putting everyone in front of you. Stop putting everyone's needs in front of yours. Terry, hey Terry. Hope that helps you anyway, sweetheart. Hey, Terry. Good morning to health. I'm going to pull some journey cards for health, actually. I'm just going to change decks. Move them out the way. You're fighting with some bothersome details at the moment, mm. and you've got, yeah, Any all decisions. right. The sun is shining on you, sweetie. All right, so that whatever is going to come out of the darkness, as far as health is concerned, is going to have light shed on yeah, it. Yeah, because I just, I just 
to balance card for All right, and also. it could be a past issue yeah. that's coming to light. Yeah. Yeah, I think you've had this health issue before and yeah. it's just resurfacing. Yeah. Um, go back, get a, go back to your GP. Yeah. Rachel, thank you, ladies. White butterflies are significant. See? There Absolutely. Go. Butterflies There's your are the goer. Yes, yes. Um, thanks to some of the other ladies. <gasps> thank Sharon, you very much, Sharon. You're a freaking star, babe. Thank um, you. I did share on the page, thanks to all the lovely pages that I, I have a look at and I think it was actually Karen that I took this from the other day I, with the feathers the different colors the different feathers. colors yes I saw that that's lovely um and good hey, evening Brad you should be working mate yeah you should be working <laughs> <laughs> um Naughty boy but yeah with all the different colors Shirley, you ladies are spot on in the way I feel. Thank you. Always looking forward to having my morning coffee with you, baby. <gasps> you are Cheers, a rock star. champion. Thank you, baby. Well done. I hope you have an awesome day. I've got cola, so I, I wish, I'm drinking coffee. I, I wish there was something that came out a little harder, but you know, <laughs> who knows? Hey, Renee. Renee. Hey, beautiful. I haven't had a chance to get that test. Do you feel I'm pregnant? <sighs> no. Um, There's the king, of, the king of water and the queen. I think that um, I don't, sorry, you need to make sorry. the time for those around you at the moment. You're dealing with challenges and I think you need to go to the doctor yeah. and have a checkup, sweet. Yeah. I really, really do. Um, I, this is going to be heartfelt mm. and this is going to be a bit compassionate and a bit respectful, but you need to... I think you need to go to the doctors and have a bit of a chat. Yeah. Unfortunately, though, darling, I, I don't feel that. Not at this time. Not at this point. I hope this helps yeah. you, sweetie. Oh, just, Thank you for jumping on, yeah. Renee. Thank you very much. And I don't think that's what you wanted to hear, but I'm sorry, sweetheart. Whoops. I've got cards felt. Surprise, surprise. Surprise, surprise, right? All righty. So it, we've got like four minutes left, guys. Jump on, make your questions count, okay? We will try and get to as many of you as possible. Well, can you just put that back up because I missed it? Sarah, well, thank you, ladies. You are more oh, than welcome. You're welcome, Sarah. Paper, what are you, can you smell that? You smell tobacco, like mm. tobacco. Very much so. Yep. Mm -hmm. Janice, love watching you, ladies. Anyone around me? Well, it's funny you say That's that because I can smell pipe tobacco. So it's I true. think it's like a grandfather. Um, he's a tall fella. He's very um, broad shoulders. Can you grab that, please? Well, no, just no. Yeah, I'll grab it. Thanks, darling. Back Sorry. Back it up. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Yeah, um, I think it's a grandfather. Um, and he, like I say, he's a very, very tall lad, like man. He's very broad shouldered. He looks a bit like a lumberjack. It's the only way I can describe it quickly. Um, the four yeah, of earth. Pipe, I can smell pipe. The pipe four of earth out. fell out, and he's trying to tell you to stop being too cautious. All right. Yeah, jump. Take okay, a leap of faith. Take a leap of faith. You're a good. You've got good decisions. Yeah. And this is the queen of water, which is getting got grasp of your emotions yeah. at the moment. I'm just going to pull one. I'm just going to pull a card because, yeah, I Hi, think Samara. A, I think it's grandfather. Oh, I see gratitude. Yeah. All right. Hi, Samara. Can I have some? And scream this heart chakra. Samara looks beautiful. She does. No. Let's go. May I have a card of gratitude? Oh. Yeah, see? And you complain about my chakra. But mine don't go on the floor. No, I can catch. <laughs> can you go? Oh, no, I can't. <laughs> That was a lie. All right. That. So um, new beginnings for you, honey. This is coming up a lot tonight. Um, can, I, can I just butt in? Yes. This is what Samara's dealing with a lot. She's dealing with a lot of people coming through her dreams. Okay. 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 Because you know they're not dreams, right? They're actually visitations, sweetie. Yes. Okay. Emotional ones. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but they are bringing you new, new beginnings, all right, and happiness, yeah. all right. So, don't don't stress too much because I feel really nervous and anxious. But don't don't stress too much. All of this is 
for a reason. They're here yeah. for a reason. They're bringing you messages, okay? Moving forward. It's stuff that you really need to hear. Okay. But, yeah, happiness for you. It's emotional and spiritual growth, so you're moving into your own at the moment. Yeah. Okay. I hope this helps you, babe. Yeah. Deb, hey, Deb, hi, ladies. Would a change in my son's medication be of benefit to him? I actually think it would. Uh, the renewal card just fell yeah, out on I, the floor. I think you I think you need to yeah. Review and evaluate. Yes. Um favorable assets of facts. Yeah. Okay, time to move in a new direction with him. Yeah. Oh look. See, trust, right? Mm -hmm. You gotta trust that you already know my love. All right, it's purple, so it's intuitive. Trust your gut feeling. All right. Yeah. You already know that that's the right answer. Yeah. And the world card came out. As well, so look, it goes twenty twenty one. So moving forward. it's moving forward. So I believe that ending one, uh, talk at least talk about okay, it. Okay, that's saying if could please watch replay. Your question was answered. It was, and it was about the the tall fellow with the lighter hair. Yes, absolutely. Well, I hope that helps you, Deb, because yeah, I, I think you need to follow your own. You yeah. know, mums know this stuff. Yeah, they, they do. They know, and if that's what you feel, then. I think we're just about out of time, guys. And I really think that you should go and have a chat about it. All right, tune in Monday night, 9.30, the Oracle Room broadcast. Tune in Wednesday at 11 a.m. to see and him. We might be seeing you. We'll Come find us at Nuri. Nuri. Right? Tune in, sign up, inquire about this 21 Love Day Love Challenge, all right? Self love is massive. Yeah, right now massive. it is. I promise you, I can change your life, all right? I, and I guarantee, even if I don't, you can have your money back. As a yes, we can. Done. I hope you guys have.